Alrighty then. Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Priscilla. Now, we are back with another series I'd like to start because the movie is quickly approaching upon us. It's called Christopher Robin, and it's a live-action Winnie the Pooh movie that Disney is putting out. So, I thought it'd be fun to go ahead and do a series on the Winnie the Pooh character, seeing as most of us have grown up with Winnie the Pooh. And he's just this timeless character, and I'd love to go ahead and teach on all the wonderful characters from a hundred acre wood. Just like he's like a boxy shape for his head. So Pooh is an easy little bit of a box if you go up. Round up the side here, box this way. Now from the box up here, what I'd like you to do is go up and down and curve into the rest of the box. And you're gonna bring down that side. And you're gonna go ahead and connect. Now let's go ahead and lay out the rest of his body. So from his head, what you're actually gonna do is you're gonna go down, go in, round off the bottom, and go up into here. So we got his round belly and then up. Now you're gonna go in right here. Go in here. And then you're gonna go down into his body. I'm gonna go back up, out, and then back in. After this, I'm gonna make a circle right here. I'm gonna bring this in. And then back in. Bring this in, back in. And you're gonna go in this way, out this way. Jump off to the side. Curve it in. Bring this down and around. We'll just go ahead and connect and actually go ahead and do this leg for now. So I go inwards, round off this side, and then go into the leg, and that foot is done. And we're actually gonna go right here and make a circle. All right, so let's jump back up to his face and piece together everything a little bit more. And jump back here to this bottom part of his head. You're gonna go up round it down and into his head and then you're gonna go up and back down and there's his two little ears and we're actually gonna round off this go up and down so you see I rounded off the bottom of this and go down and then you're gonna go up. And his nose is gonna go up. And then his snout will be rounded off a little bit more. Go in with his smile. And then curve this way. Go in with the bottom of his lip and just go inwards just a little bit to give a little bit more definition. And you're actually going to go underneath his lip, go out and in. And then you're going to jump right here. You're going to curve down this line right here. You're gonna make a little itty bitty pupil right at the edge of that line. And then you're gonna jump right here and make an eyebrow. Now the reason why this is one of my favorite images of Winnie the Pooh is because I actually did a really big colorful drawing of this. I love the butterfly on his nose. For the butterfly in his nose, I'm going to make like a little head to my butterfly and then the body's going to go sit on top of his nose and the 
body will go out, back in, and I'm going to go up with his wings. So I'm going to go up, round it down, and back into his body. And I'm going to go behind right here, bring this down, back into the body, and I'm going to jump in right in the middle of these two wings and make the other side. And I'm going to jump right here on the other wing, bring out this side, and curve inwards. And then make a little antenna, another little antenna, and just divide up his body a little bit more. I'm going to make the little butterfly have a little bit of designs on it. And this one. And this one. The only thing Pooh is wearing is his cute little red shirt. So for his shirt, we're going to go behind his head, bring out his collar, go back in, and I'm going to round off the top of his collar. So I'm going to keep this part right here, round it out, go outwards, and I'm going to bring out this part of his other side of his collar, go in, and then I'm going to go down. out, back into his belly, and I'm going to make a line right here, and you're going to curve the shirt in, go up, into his arm, and then he's got a big sleeve, so we're going to go up from his arm right here, go up, Keep his overall arm, just go down, connect, I'm going to make a line here, a line here, I'm going to make a line on top of his shoulder, make a line here, line here and here, and a line here. So that's his shirt. And his arm should go in, make a more definite line here, make this line here, and then go in and back into his belly. Now the only thing we have to straighten up here is on his foot. You're going to go up a little bit more, go ahead and curve that in, and I'm going to curve in his leg just a little and go back into his thigh, and this is good here, and you're just going to go ahead and give him more of a little paw pad.